Well, good, wonderful, beautiful morning, audience. Do you girls know what's happening? They're like, there's a suitcase and you took stuff out to the car. We're pretty sure we're going for an R-I-D-E. Are you pretty sure, huh? You're following me. Guess what, guys? We're heading to Canada. So by the time you guys see this, we'll still be in Canada, I believe. So by the time you guys see this, we'll actually still be in Canada. We're going to stay there till either Monday, Tuesday, or Wednesday of next week. And this, I believe, is going up Monday after the Pet Expo. So we're on our way to the Canadian Pet Expo. But if you're watching this, we were actually there this previous weekend, if that makes sense. Our vlogs are a little delayed. That's why it's important for you guys to follow us at Instagram. Instagram.com slash snowdogsvlogs and Instagram.com slash gone to the snowdogs for real-time updates. Is something for you, huh? Um, can I also get a medium diet Coke? Yeah. Okay. Gotta start the day off right, right? Yeah, gotta yeah. have breakfast. Gotta Bye. have our, our McDonald's. Yep, that's it. Alright, 9.30 after that, we can go. Yeah, you can see that right there in the field. Looks like raindrops on the windshield, but welcome to buck season. It's 57 degrees it, outside. It is 57 degrees outside, and we're headed to Canada. And, and got, there's already bugs. And we got the dogs, and yes, there is already bugs in the window. Can winter come back, please? Say a lot of you probably already been through bug season, but we get it really bad up here to where we have to pretty much stop and pull over and clean our windshield. Yeah. <laughs> well, yeah, we'll, we'll have to show you some of the bug plumes at the tops of the trees every once in a while. There's water out there. That's oh, yeah. why they have so many bugs. Because yeah. there's so much water just sitting everywhere from the snow melt. Yep, our ground is still frozen. Well, maybe not on the top, but I'm sure underneath it still might be a little frosty. I don't know. Maybe not. It's been 50, over 50 for a couple days now. Yeah. Yuck bugs. Yep. Here's our view. We're going. Are you ready? <laughs> she looks like she's gonna take off. Yeah. Dog, you stay in the back. <laughs> so we have made our first stop for the dogs to take a break. We're about an hour and a half away from home. Weird. Remember what happened last time we were here? We were broke down. We're at that gas station where we broke down at the Jeep. But we're not broke down this time because um, you guys can't really tell, but we did upgrade the Jeep. We, we traded our Jeep in. For one with less miles. We didn't really tell you guys. I did it like, was it yesterday? Day before yesterday? Two days ago. Yeah, and the funny thing is, is uh, this is this is how our dealer in Alpina, I don't know, deals with us, but yeah. essentially, definitely takes Jessica seriously now <laughs> because uh, it was funny. Jessica said something about the water pump, water pump to the dealer, and uh, they within two weeks they found. This Jeep. Uh, yeah, pretty much the Jeep that they go, oh, Jess will buy that. She said she, <laughs> she said she was going to buy another one because her water pump broke. And I had made the joke, and I had made the joke to them that I was going to do that, but we hadn't really, like, talked about it. It was kind of a joke. And then they found this one, and my payment my payment went up, like, $30, so. Well, and truth was, is when we, when we first got this vehicle, we wanted it with less miles yeah. than the one we'd previously gotten. The but. previous one we bought had 38,000 miles on it when we bought it. Yeah, and that was a little high for what we wanted for a newer vehicle. I mean, when we wanted a new vehicle, we're gonna pay money for it. And we wanna keep it for like five years. Like that's oh, usually yeah, the plan. Yeah. We wanna keep well, it for a longer just time. Five years, hopefully. So this one had 10,000 miles on it when we bought it. And it's, it's the exact, you guys saw, same Jeep, same color. It's just one year newer, that's all. That's the only difference. And I didn't really, we didn't really talk about it because I kind of just everything happened real fast. It was yeah, like, oh, really hey, busy, here we go. Yeah. That's what I said. Mm -hmm. All right, we got a long way to go. I'm turning this car on so we can hit the road. You're what do you think, Memphis? In, huh? Yeah. As I says, bridge to Canada, get in that lane. Oh, we're gonna follow this car. Right? Are you ready, huh? Follow me, Memphis. Ready to go to Canada? She's like, I am so ready. <laughs> That Shelby back there too. Hi, Shelby. Hi. Did you sit up to look over the bridge, huh? Yeah. I did. All right, we still got a couple miles. See, there's the bridge up there. Uh, trap up oh, there. You can see it kind of. Traffic's kind of blocking it. There's definitely 
Valley Bridge. Here, we'll, we'll take you over it here in a second. We gotta pay the toll. Open all traffic. Cool. They opened another lane for us. Sweet. Look at all the people trying to get back in. Oh, yeah, it's a little bit slower getting back in. Oh, no. Look at all the trucks. Holy all the cow. semi trucks coming back in. Oh, my gosh. I don't know. <laughs> I, th this way was fast so far. We still gotta go through customs, so. Oh, yeah, man. Look at ready. all the. Cell phone use is not permitted. Cars and RVs only. Cool. Oh my gosh. We're going Okay, so Canada, we're going guys. over the bridge. I don't know what river that is. Oh, it's so blue. St. Clair River? Is it? I don't know. I don't either. <laughs> I would oh, just I don't guess. Like this bridge. Yeah. <laughs> You know, at first on the map, oh, I was I like wondering. This less than the Mackinac Bridge. Right, I was wondering why there were two identical bridges, but then I realized it's a freeway. <laughs> oh, I don't like this at all. Oh. Wow. Hi, Semi. I'm just gonna watch the car in front of me. Yep. Wow, they're stopped on that bridge. Oh my God, we're in, uh, uh, we're going to Detroit to come. Yeah, home. we might go through the tunnel <laughs> to get home. Oh, wow. I don't like that at all. And there, the whole bridge. Well, wow. it's harder to get into the United States than it is to Canada. Somebody told me that. Yeah. This Maximum takes 50. Kilometers. Switch you to kilometers. You're going 60 kilometers. Oh, it was. Huh? Okay, now we got to get ready to go through customs. So that was all that. Here's the river again. It's a really bright blue I know, river. It's so bright. Look at all the industry over there. Yeah, I see that. Canada. Wait, 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 don't turn it off because officially, I think right now we're officially in Canada. There's land below us and it's Canadian. It is? It, we are. All right. I gotta do the thing and switch my yep. kilometers. All right, so this should be pretty quick. I'm gonna get ready. Okay. There's the sign. Yay. We officially made it. We made that it was, to Canada. Currency nice. exchange. Yep, just follow the black car ahead of us. That was way easier than I thought. Yeah. No, I knew it would be. Like they just let us in. Man, look at all the traffic coming in. I know, we're totally uh, not Other people just back. jump off the road. Yeah, oh we're totally not coming back this way. Yeah, I don't. We stuck there for Yeah, I think you might be right. We might just scurry. Because it, it'll be an extra, what, two hours added? Two and a half hours yeah. added, maybe? All right, headed to London. London. Next up, London. Oh, they want all the treats. Do the treats smell better up here in Canada? Mm -hmm. <laughs> They found the treat aisle. Oh, we made it to Canada and we're stopping at PetSmart because the dogs need some food and some treats and we figured this would be pee easier. Yeah, they all had to pee. Ooh, look at all the good things, Shelby. Mm -hmm. There's going to be lots of things at the expo tomorrow. I don't mm -hmm. think you're going to get too many treats here. We'll probably pick some up there. What do you think? Yeah, we'll probably just get food for you. Yeah, get you a little bit of food. We're about 30 minutes from the hotel, so... Mm, sniffing all the things. Mm -hmm. They also really need it out of the car. And it's raining, so this works pretty good. <laughs> there's there's cat food over here. You don't want the cat food. Yeah, That's a cat tree. The uh oh. There's cats over here? Yeah. No. Rare. Let's not, Memphis. <laughs> Come on, Memphis. No, yeah, you don't want to see the cats. Them. No. <laughs> Come on, Memphis. <laughs> <laughs> Memphis is like, there's oh, there's a bunny. Be careful. Oh, jeez, I'm glad you said that. There's a bunny I in there. See. Stay away from the bunny. <sighs> we made it. Here comes one. Yep. Can you hear it? I can't. It's right there. <laughs> the planes literally go right over this hotel. You can't super hear it, but hey, I put that there for Shelby to help her get on the bed. Shelby's like, I figured it out, Mom. I got on the bed. So I wanted to give you guys a quick room tour. Apparently we have a king size bed. Good, because we have two dogs. It's got a nice TV. Oh, there it goes. <laughs> uh, little sitting area. There's a little bench over here. This, I think this will work out pretty good for the next couple days. And then there is a microwave. There's a mini fridge. So I'm gonna go get a little bit of stuff for there. Nice little closet area with a safe. Did you see this bathroom? It's pretty, uh, hi. It's huge, yeah. And the shower doesn't have a door. It has like a half door. It's interesting. It's different. Why does that look like it's pointed up? It probably is. So anyway, that's the room tour. Yeah, I think we're gonna chill out for a little bit, figure out food. What do you think? She's like, I'm ready for food and water and a nap. I bet you are, honey, I bet you are. 
Weird, it's just like home. <laughs> Hi, Shelby. We got pizza for dinner because it was easy and we were starving. And Shelby situated Quick. herself right underneath the table. Hi. Memphis is over there at eye level. <laughs> but Shelby is right here. Mm, you just ate. Yeah, you just ate, honey. So I read online that there were certain types of dog foods that you couldn't bring into Canada. And I think one of them said if they had lamb in it, which Memphis's food actually did. So we decided when we got here, we were just gonna buy two small bags of dog food over at PetSmart. And they had Shelby's food. Right now I have her on this, it's a limited ingredient. It's upside down, sorry. This is the Natural Balance Limited Ingredient. It's sweet potato and venison because it's lower in phosphorus and lower in protein, which they said she needed because of her early stage kidney disease. I don't have her on the prescription diet and thinking about it, we haven't decided. But they didn't have Memphis's food. So Memphis is trying this. Wild caught salmon and chickpea recipe. She seems to like it. I figure she can eat it for a couple of days. She'll be okay with it. If anything, she does like Shelby's food. So I guess I could have just fed her Shelby's food the whole time. <laughs> you wouldn't have cared, would you? So yeah, I read a couple reviews on it before I bought it and it seemed like a pretty decent food. So that's what she had. Of course, they also shared our pizza. I know, we're gonna go outside. Daddy had to go out to the car and get the poop bags because look, I remembered all the things. I got dental things, I got your toothbrushes, I got your bowls, I got the measuring cup. We got food now, we got treats. I got the adaptable travel stuff because that helps keep them calm. We got everything set up in here, but I left the poop bags in the car. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> Remember how when we were driving up here, we showed how wet everything was? That's Greg's yard. He just sent us that picture. It's pretty wet there too. Look at, we had to get Canadian monies. Yeah, so here's their 20. That's pretty cool. See through, yeah, oops, see, see my hand behind there? That's kinda neat. And there's their five. No. Nope. And then their 10 I noticed uh, is crooked. It goes this way. So. That's kinda neat. On the back of it. Oh, it also goes that way. Huh. We don't have any loonies or toonies right now. No, we need to bend them. But we got some money. We wanted yeah, to make sure we had some Canadian cash. Our Visa card works pretty much yeah. everywhere up here, but we wanted to make sure we had some cash just to be safe. Don't eat the money. Mm -hmm. We've done it before. <laughs> yeah, you ate a five. Yeah, you did. American. Hey, your tongue is sticking out. Did you finally cool off after the walk? Guys, it was like 72 and super humid. Oh, I said that, I said it, I didn't spell it, I said it. Oh, you did. I guess it means we have to go outside, huh? I didn't mean to wake you up. Mm -hmm. Your tongue is sticking out. You've been out for like two hours, did it's you like know you that? Said that other word, Mom. I know. Oh. Jamie played his game, I edited a video. Oh yeah, yeah, what do you think, huh? You seem pretty happy. You ate your dinner, you ate your dinner. Mm -hmm. Well, I guess before we say goodnight to everybody, we'll take you out one more time and then we'll say goodnight. Mm -hmm. Gotta do the, prop the proper things, right? You ready to go meet a whole bunch of people tomorrow? Are I'm you? excited for you. I'm excited for them too. Are you excited, Memphis? You ready to see some more of Canada? Not really too much more tomorrow, but in a few days. In a few days, we'll take it to Niagara Falls. What do you think of that? That'd be pretty cool, but I don't know what you're saying. Oh, apparently we're going O-U-T-S-I-D-E. I guess I don't have to spell it now that they already figured it out. Yeah. <laughs> you found the spot, huh? Right in front of the fan they brought us. So far the only complaint we have about the room is we have the, we have the Air conditioning said it's 66 and it's 71 in here and it has not gone down. Kind of a bummer. You seem to be doing a little bit better though, huh? You weren't too happy earlier, but you're doing better now, right? She's like, shut up and go to bed. Would you just shut up and go to bed already? Yeah, we can go to bed now, Shelby. We can go to bed now. All right, you guys, we're gonna go to bed. We gotta get up early, we got a lot to do tomorrow. We'll try to film as much as we can. Don't let me forget to film, okay, Jamie? We'll try to remember to film as much as we can. All right, you guys, we hope you enjoyed today's video. Thanks so much for watching. Stay positive, dream big. We will see you again soon. Good night, audience. Did you, you got a bed night treat. You're good. You're good. 
If you love our huskies, come along for the ride. All you have to do is hit subscribe. Follow as we share our lives with our dogs and join our adventures on Snow Dog Vlogs.